come into our newsroom. California voters are showing great interest in the outcoming of the upcoming presidential race. Now registrations are up and now the state is kicking in more money to handle that increase in voters. News Channel 3 senior reporter John Palminteri joins us live from Santa Barbara and John it looks to be a very busy election day. Oh some strong indicators are certainly out there with an increase in registrations, more funding coming into elections offices and voter outreach is certainly just about everywhere you turn and what that means is it looks like it's going to be a lot of participation in the June 7th primary. He is the first presidential candidate. Bellowing and yelling. Two sides of the same coin. Voters say whether it's by habit or because of the tone of this year's election, they are very engaged in the process. Probably because of the freak show that it's become and how um, just how insane it all looks. I think people are motivated maybe a little bit more this time to participate. Oh, you because of the surge in interest in the June 7th primary election, California counties are getting 16 million more dollars from the state to handle the rising paperwork from newly registered voters. Already, the state says 600,000 new voters have signed up and the deadline is still about three weeks away. One voter says it's going to make a difference. This year's presidential campaigns are a good example uh, because in, in at least two cases there are candidates who could have been completely written off a few months ago and who all of a sudden are viable. The state is also looking at a plan to allow voter registration up to and including election day beginning next year. Right now the cutoff is two weeks prior to that. Oh yeah, I think that's a really good idea actually. Um, a lot of people just don't really think about it until the last minute. Especially, you know, like what if you turn 18 that day, you know? So yeah. that'd be a good, a good thing for those people. That if you're not participating, you can't really complain in the outcome. If you participate, then, you know, have at it. <laughs> but if you, if you aren't doing anything, then you're part of the problems. There are two key dates remaining for you to remember. May 23rd, that is the deadline to register if you need to do that or change your current registration. And May 9th, which is the day the vote by mail ballots will be available. And you can actually vote on that day at an elections office and be done with it. Reporting live in Santa Barbara, I'm John Palmentary, News Channel 3. Okay, no reason not to vote. Thanks, John. A groundbreaking ceremony today.